I'm just walking alongside a field of maize and you might see this growing near you. Let's take a little bit look from a bit higher. I feel like Kevin Cosner, I just want to walk in there, but this belongs to a farmer. Anyway, quite often people pick this stuff. You shouldn't really pick it and they take it home, cook it and they message me because they've picked what they think is sweet corn, take it home to cook it and it just doesn't go soft. You can't eat it. And this is maize and it's grown for a few reasons. And just down by my bag is a bit that's come down in the wind. So I'm going to show you what it's like when you open it up. So these are the, the heads on there. Look at that. And there's the leftover flour um, on the top. So we peel down the sides and you'll see, see it open up. It won't quite be ready this one, but you get the idea of it. Here we go. Look at that. Look at that there. So I say you shouldn't really pick this stuff, but this is wind damage. Quite a lot of it comes down in the high winds we have. Yeah, look at that sweet corn. So maize looks like sweet corn same family why are they growing it well it's a really good crop to grow you can grow it so it's high in starch you can grow it so it's high in energy you can grow it so it's very dry and it's used a lot for feeding cattle a tmr diet a total mixed rotation so we have this idea that a lot of our livestock are grass fed but they're not always most of the time and especially abroad they're fed on stuff that's grown to feed them and quite often maize is grown in order to feed livestock and the other reason it's grown is it goes into anaerobic digesters which um, help to generate electricity so that's where it goes to as well so they're the two kind of main reasons it's grown and it's it's good to go in straight after a cover crop and you sow it kind of april time and then harvesting it now what is it september now so harvesting it's harvesting it anytime soon but yeah it doesn't look great to see that growing so not many people had this growing near them so i thought i'd do a little video about it but yeah it's generally not for us to eat it's for the livestock and for an anaerobic digesters and various other reasons but they're like the top two reasons so yeah how about that it grows really tall doesn't it as well behind me cheers guys get wild